In Brazil, the presidential elections are officially over and the counting of votes has begun. The political parties and the citizens await the results. Amid tensions, our correspondent Brian Mir brings us the details. All voting in Brazil's 2022 elections has officially ended as of 5 p.m. And former president Luiz Inácio Lula da Silva is in the hotel behind me with his closest friends and family members waiting for the results of the vote tally, which could take as little as three or four hours. Former President Jair Bolsonaro voted in Rio de Janeiro today and immediately flew back to Brasilia where he's waiting for the results. The big question is, was Lula able to gain enough momentum to win the election in the first round? Several polls had him within the range of a possible 50% plus one that would give him victory. Regardless of what happens, the social movements and unions are going to go out to Paulista Avenue in downtown Sao Paulo as soon as the results are announced to take to the streets and celebrate whether it's a first round victory or just a simple victory that will carry the election to a vote off, a runoff at the end of October between the top two candidates who are presumed to be Lula and current president Jair Bolsonaro. So the mood here is tense, but all people can do now is just wait and see what happens. And the next couple hours are going to be pretty hard for millions of people here in Brazil.